you have an iPhone 11, 12, 13, or 14, you have an issue where your airdrop is grayed out. You can see right there. Really quickly, to get to the control center, top right-hand side, swipe down. If I press and hold right here, there's my airdrop, okay? It's grayed out. I'm going to give you several solutions to get you up and running right now. First thing to try is a software update. Go to settings, and then from here, scroll down, and you want to go to general. Tap on general. Now, software update. Tap on software update, and see if you an update available. I have a 16.3 iOS available. If you have one available, go ahead and download, and then make sure you install it, okay? And then see if your airdrop now can turn on and off, okay? If not, we're gonna to go to the next possible solution. So the next thing is you may have it disabled, okay? So what we wanna do is go into settings again, and then from settings, we want to go to screen time, okay? So we're going to go down, okay? Screen time is right here. Let's tap on screen time, all right? Now from here, let's go ahead and scroll up and let's go to content and privacy restrictions, okay? Let's tap on that right there. Now, let's tap on allow apps, okay? Let's tap on that. And now scroll down and look for airdrop. There's my airdrop. Hey, what do you know? That toggle is off. Let me go ahead and toggle it on. And now top right hand side, let me slide down. Let me press and hold. And voila, airdrop is there, okay? And if you press and hold, you can do receiving off, contacts only, or everyone, okay? Let me go ahead and turn it off. So even if you turn it off, you can go ahead and tap it, and then you can do contacts or everyone as well. I'll go ahead and leave mine on everyone. Now, if it's still grayed out, top right-hand side, if it's still grayed out right here, the next thing is this, okay? Just go top right-hand side, and then tap on airplane mode. Tap on airplane mode. Wait 15 seconds, after 15 seconds, go ahead and turn it back off. And now, look at your airdrop and see if you can, if it's uh, no longer grayed out, okay? If it's still grayed out, then we're gonna go to the next possible solution. So if yours is still grayed out, no problem. Next thing we're gonna do here is we're gonna simply force restart our um, iPhone. To force restart it, it's a three key combination. What you wanna do is press the volume, um, and how you do a force restart again is a three combination, three three key combination. What you want to do is press the volume up, then volume down, and then press and hold that power button and do not let go until you see an Apple logo appear. So let's just do this together, okay? Ready? Volume up, volume down, press and hold that power button, do not let go. Keep on holding onto that power button. Don't worry about what's on the screen. Continue to hold that power button until you see an Apple logo, okay? I'm still holding onto the power button here. Phone just turned off, now it's going to turn back on, and then I should see an Apple logo. Apple logo, go ahead and let go and let this boot up normally and then we'll check to see if your airdrop is working. Once it boots back up, top right hand side, slide down, press and hold around here and see if you can turn on your airdrop, all right? All right, so your airdrop is still grayed out. So the next thing is, again, what we wanna do is go directly to settings. Then we're gonna to go to general, let's go down, there's general. And then from here, we're gonna scroll all the way up Second to the bottom, it should say transfer or reset iPhone, okay? Just go ahead and click on that. And then what we wanna do is click on reset, okay? Just tap on reset, and now we have a bunch of options on here. Now, what you wanna do is try the reset network settings. Now, once you click on that, you put in your password, it's gonna go ahead and reset your network settings. That's gonna reset your all your network, your VPNs, and so on. So in other words, once you do the uh, network reset, you will have to uh, log into your Wi-Fi, put in your Wi-Fi password and all that stuff. And this is the last step I have for you. So if you're still at this last step, once you do this, it should work. If it's still down, try from the um, very first step in the video and try every single step again, okay? If it worked for you, give me a thumbs up. If not, give me a thumbs down, all right? Good luck, guys. Bye.